I spent three-fourth of my money, then two-fifth of the rest, and I still have $30 left. How much did I spend? I am now showing the four bars, and later we will identify the three-fourth or three parts of four. Here's the yellow shaded three as part of a whole. which is 3 fourth. I equally divided the remaining blue bar by 5 because later on, we're going to show this. Another money spent, which is 2 fifth. You can see the red shaded here, the 2 out of 5. And the indicated green shaded signifies that there is $30 left. As you can see here, going back to the question, how much money did I spend? Let's now focus on the $30 left. Let's now divide 30 by 3. Because we will base the three green shaded part, which is worth $30. This means that the value per unit is 10. Now, how can we get the unit? Let's see. First, let's divide the bars equally. the value per unit. Let's always remember that 10 was taken when we divided the $30 left by 3. 3 according to the 3 green shaded bars. Here we go. Let's wait until all the bars will filled with 10 as the value per unit. Let me repeat the problem. I spent three-fourths of my money then two-fifths of the rest and still have $30 left. How much did I spend? Let's count the total number of units. Let's count the first five. One, two, three, four, five. And then six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Since we have 20 units, let's multiply $10 by 20. We have the total amount of money spent and left, which is $200. Okay, let's now compute the money that I spent. The three 
fourth part of the certain amount is 150 because I multiply $10 by 15 as you can see there. The two-fifth part of a certain amount is now discovered as $20. And their sum is $170. Or, you can directly multiply $10 by 17 and you will still end up with $170. We now have the answer to the question, how much did I spend? The total amount of money that I spent is $170.